This screencast talks through how to add and manipulate charts in pages. To put a chart in is simply a case of tapping the plus symbol, choosing charts, choosing whether you want a 2D chart or a 3D chart, scrolling through and finding the style that you want, and then tapping it once in order for it to appear on your page. Once it's in, if you want to move it around, tap anywhere on the actual chart except the sensor bit. The sensor bit is for moving it around and making it 3D like so. But if you move into any of the other areas you can then tap and drag it down. You can see the title test scores moved and the whole chart moved there. Now once it's highlighted you've got a number of handles you can use. The blue handles enable you to resize uh, scale up and down and what have you your chart. The green handles enable you to get in to edit the data and that's really key because you want to be able to change the values that are in there. So if you go into edit data it will flip around and give you a little spreadsheet table kind of thing so you can add in what it is you want to work on. So let's say it is test scores and Jane uh, was the first student and Bob was the second student. Let's just for argument's sake add in an extra student called Sam and I'll just pop in some scores for Sam uh, like so and just tap done when done and it will flip round and you can then see the results on the chart. Obviously you might want to put more stats in and fiddle around with it uh, to suit your needs but as you can see it's a particularly powerful looking chart really really ple pleasing to look at and another really nice feature of pages the app for iPad thank you for listening I'm Mark Anderson